Hello. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? Good. Good. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Good. 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 Okay. Welcome. Welcome to another class, another day of learning. It's going to be nice to have you here. Well, 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 well. Welcome. Hello, good evening. Welcome. How are you, my Hello, dear? Teacher. Hello, how are you today? ¿Cómo estamos? I'm fine. <laughs> Excellent. I am very happy to have you here. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. So, this was a very crazy day, rainy, not rainy, hot, not hot. So, it was a, it was a terrible weather day. I thought it was going to rain a lot. Yo creí que iba a llover un montón. But then, nothing. So, it was, it was a very crazy weather day. So but I am happy to have you here and for sure to have another opportunity of learning. Tell me, what do you remember from yesterday's class? Ben, of course. Vamos a ver. What do you remember from yesterday's class? Let's see. We Brand. were studying. Branch. Uh -huh. We were studying countables, some countables. What else? Breakfast, brunch, meals. Exactly. We talk about the different uh, moments of food, right? Los diferentes momentos cuando comemos. Breakfast, lunch, dinner. Uh -huh. Salad. Excellent. We use, we talk about how to talk about uh, the things that we have in the refrigerator, right? Welcome everybody. I can see many of you connected now. Damisela, creo que se nos ha bloqueado la cámara. Sí, dicho, pero no sé cómo hacer. Eh, yo creo que en el teclado, a los botones de arriba, en los botones de arriba, al teclado de su laptop, porque me imagino que en su laptop está. Sí. Eh, hay un botoncito que tiene una camarita y una X, está arriba del número 8. Ah, ah, ah ya. There you go. <laughs> Yay. Thank you, teacher. You see? Thank you. <laughs> so, it, maybe when you were typing, you press it. That, that happened to be in the previous class. Me pasó en hace unos minutos. No, yo la bloqueé. La cámara. Oh, hmm, you see, no candies for you. No candies tomorrow. Well, so today we are going to be working a little bit on uh, uh, the ending of the topic about food and we're going to start the, our last topic. Vamos a empezar nuestro último tema hoy, that it's about sports, right? We are going to talk about sports and that is going to be our final topic. It's about to finish, right? We are about to finish, but uh, everything is ready for the next one. Yo creo que ya estamos listos y preparados para the next one. So I hope all of you are uh, done with your sign up documents for the next group. So let's work. Here I am going to talk about the adverbs of frequency that is the one that we started talking about yesterday and in this one we are going to talk about the frequency that we use for different things for example when you say i always eat this i never eat that right so we are going to be using this one for us to complete the sentences with the adverbs of frequency here I have it. Let me share it with you. Okay, le voy a compartir la pantalla. And we're going to explain. We're going to explain a little bit about this. Here we go. Okay, so this is what we were studying yesterday. And we were talking about the different adverbs of frequency. Okay, we did this one, right? That you say fish for breakfast. Hmm, that's interesting. 
that you say like, mm, I don't really like it, right? Fish for breakfast? Hmm, I don't know. We usually have fish, rice, and soup. What do you normally have for breakfast, people? What is something that you usually have for breakfast? I always have beans, eggs, yes. and creams. What do you have for breakfast? Eggs, tomato, salsa, salsa. Tomato sauce, uh-huh, tomato sauce. Yeah. Yeah. Cheese. Cheese, good. Cheese, plátano, fried bananas. Fried, fried bananas, fried bananas, sandwiches, right? Sandwiches. <laughs> you don't, you don't like sandwiches for breakfast? No, no. Only in the trips. I prefer beans. I prefer. So you say I prefer. Yeah. Beans. Okay. The, the, the sandwiches when you go to the beach, right? On your way to Caluco, maybe. Then you can have sandwiches for breakfast. That is that is really nice when you go to the beach, right? Todos los días para ir a trabajar is like, I no, I don't want to go. And when you have a trip, when you go to the beach or something, cuando vamos para la playa, para el lago, para donde sea, three in the morning preparing the sandwich. Yo siempre quiero sandwiches. Yeah, they are very good. I like chicken sandwiches. They are very delicious. Well, for breakfast, cereal is another thing that it's very popular, right? Cereal, granola, it's also popular that you that you take granola with milk. It's very delicious. I really like it. So let's go here in the adverbs of frequency. When you talk about the adverbs of frequency, here you can make this kind of, uh, you divide how uh, frequent is something in your life and you can say for example something happens always something that happens almost always something that happens that never happens right so that is the form of these ones and you can use it to express right how frequent something happened in your life and for that one you can say i always eat cereal i never eat salad right? That can be the use of the adverbs of frequency. I have here one example for all of you, and let me share it, because here we have, I always. How do you make it in sentence? En una oración, ¿cómo lo ponemos? You say, the first thing that you use is the subject, right? El sujeto es lo primero que ponemos. I, you, we, they, he, she, it, any of them. Then the adverb of frequency. Always significa el 100% de las veces. Usually, then 80%. Often, 75%. Sometimes, 50%. Hardly ever, 40%. Never, 0%. The only adverb of frequency that can be at the beginning of the sentence is sometimes. Sometimes es el único que puede estar al principio de la oración. Todos los demás van después del sujeto. Okay, there you have the subject and all of them here. Sometimes is the only one that can be at the beginning or after the subject. And then you have the verb and the complement, right? The change. You might say, teacher, but what about he and she? And you say, she, that is the subject in this case, you say, she, you are going to have the normal subject. Sometimes eats breakfast, ¿ok? Porque tenemos una forma de tercera persona y el verbo igual va a cambiar. Okay, she sometimes eats. But I have more examples right here. Por aquí tengo más ejemplos. Let's work on this one. And it says, let me see here. And it says, how often do you cook people? ¿Qué tan seguido cocina? How often do you cook? Hardly ever. Sometimes, often, or every day? Every day. Every, every day. day. Every day. Sometimes. sometimes, right? Some of you say sometimes. 
always yeah. every day <laughs> uh, always and every day right all day. yeah when do you need to cook every single day how often do you go jogging ¿Qué tan seguido salen a trotar? Uh, never. Uh, never. Never. <laughs> never. Never. Rarely. Sometimes or often. Never. Seldom. <laughs> Seldom, teacher. Never, you say. Never. Hoy <laughs> empecé. Hey, that's so nice, right? I always say that. Yo siempre le digo, si me ven corriendo, corran. Porque algo está pasando. <laughs> yeah, porque I never run. Y si me ven corriendo, corran. <laughs> because, because something is happening. So, never. Right? How often do you watch TV? Every day. Ah, all the time, every day. Always teach. Always and forever. Sometimes. 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 How often do you go to the gym? Yeah, I never. Never. <laughs> I never teach. Solo mental teaching. ¿Qué es eso? <laughs> I, I, love, I love the tone that you use. You're like, oh, I never teach. Con aquí alta, así de, ay, no. Solo de decirlo me canso. Usted me tiró una okay. vez, ¿eh? <laughs> Aunque me regañe mis hijas que no lo hago. <laughs> I never go to the gym, you say. Yeah, it's necessary, but in some cases, we don't have the time, right? Yeah. I never go to the gym. You have to make the gym in your house, right? Here. You have to make the gym. pero voy a bailar. Voy a clase de baile. Hey, that's nice, right? <laughs> Okay. You go to dance classes, right? In some cases, we do Zumba here with my son. We dance in, with videos from YouTube. So you can you can do it at home, right? So here we have the different forms and the percentages of the adverbs of frequency. How much is for each of the categories? <laughs> and it says... Sí, siempre va antes, siempre va antes. No. Siempre va antes, ajá. So, yes, el único que puede ir antes del sujeto es sometimes. sometimes. El único. And then the other ones, it's always after the verb. And it says, uh, the percentages that you have, 100% always. always. 90, usually. 80, normally. 70, often. 50%, sometimes. 30% occasionally. Occasionally is like, yeah, yeah, and cuando, right? Occasionally. Seldom. Seldom is like, I almost never, teacher. Hardly ever, casi nunca. And never, that is 0%. Teacher, podría decir lo que significa en español. Oh, yeah, for sure. Here you have siempre. Usualmente, normalmente, seguido, a veces, okay. ocasionalmente. Oh, ya lo, ya lo, tomé foto. And here you have a seldom, it's like rara veces. I Hardly play. ever, casi nunca, and never, nunca. Teacher. Yes. Yo ayer es el del 5%, el hardly, hardly ever, mm -hmm. and rarely. Rarely. R rarely, that's another one, yes, for sure. Yeah, that's another one that we have here. It can be here in the middle. Rarely. Rarely is like, yeah, yeah. Cuando se muere un burro, right? Rarely. <laughs> it's similar to hardly ever. Rarely. Ah, okay. This is the same in the same level of hardly ever. Rarely, right? It's like, rara veces, teacher. Like, how often do you go to the beach? I rarely go to the beach. No. Maybe one time a year. If I go two times, it's a lot. How often do you go to the beach? ¿Qué tan seguido van a la playa ustedes? Never. <laughs> Never. Sometimes. Sometimes, okay. De todo el año, 50%. Seldom. Seldom. <laughs> yeah, I seldom go to the beach. Maybe. Only in August and in December. With luck. If I am lucky enough, two times a year. If not, only in December. So, 
that it's seldom. How often do you eat pupusas? Never. Always. <laughs> <laughs> I always eat pupusa. Always. How, how often? How often do you eat quesadilla? Occasion. <laughs> you don't like it, Sandrita. You don't like it. Sometimes. Sometimes you say. How often do you eat loroco? Never. Never. Oh my God. Never. How often do you eat chicken? Sometimes. <laughs> Seldom. <laughs> Never. How often do you eat Mexican food? Sometimes. Sometimes, occasionally, right? So that's the question. That is the form of question. ¿Qué pregunta les he estado utilizando? How often? How often? How often? Exactly, how right? How, how often? In this how. case, when you say how often, it's like que tan seguido. How often? Often. How often? And then you have the sentence, right? How often? A menudo. Exactly. How, how often, often do you? And then you have how often do you cook beans? And then you have one sentence, right? How often do you cook beans? ¿Qué tan seguido cocinan frijoles? How often? No. Cook. How often do you cook? Always. 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 They say. No puede faltar. You cannot miss it, right? How often do you cook beans, right? I often cook beans, right? I sometimes cook beans. I cook beans every month. Okay. And in this one, we have the other types of sentences, yeah. right? You can use the definite frequency adverbs, right? I, every Sunday, every Monday, for example. Sí, so, es una vez al mes o, eh, de, de, no. Once one a year. Once, once, once a week. Yeah. Once a week significa no, una vez a la semana. Once a week. Once, yeah, once, 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 once a month. Mes. Once, once a month. Once a month, right? Once a month. Once uh -huh. significa uh -huh. una vez. Ah. Uh -huh. So you say once uh -huh. a week, once a month. Okay. Okay. But in this case, the once a week, once a month, every day or something, these are adverbs of definite frequency, right? Todos estos que les estoy mostrando aquí, always, usually, normally, often, sometimes, and all these ones, they are adverbs of indefinite frequency. Todos estos son de frecuencia indefinida. Porque decimos, ah, always, teacher. Always puede ser todos los sábados, todos los lunes, todas las semanas. Siempre es. ¿Cuánto es siempre para usted? Todo el año, right? So this is indefinite. But if you use these ones, the other ones that you say every Monday, every Saturday, every Thursday, these are definite frequency adverbs, okay? But that is another, another list that I'm going to show you later. And it says, I always have breakfast at 8 a.m. Every day, all the time is the same, right? I always have breakfast at 8 a.m. Eso pasa todos los días. Eso quiere oh. decir que usted a las 8 en punto está sentada comiendo. Right? I usually take a shower at 6 in the morning. I usually take a shower. Algunos días a las 6 y 10, algunos días a las 6 y 15. So I usually take a, a shower at 6 in the morning. I normally go to work at 8 a.m. Right? Normally go to work because that's the time that you have set, right? Hay días que le agarra la tarde. Hay días que se va más antes. But normally at eight. I often eat chicken at lunch. Sometimes meat, sometimes tacos, sometimes pupusas. I often eat chicken at lunch. I sometimes buy lunch at work. Si decimos que algunas veces lo compramos, otras veces lo cocinamos, right? I sometimes buy lunch at work. I occasionally go to the gym from time to time. I seldom go to the beach. Ah, yeah, una vez al año. 
I hardly ever sleep early. ¿Por qué? Porque tengo clase a las nueve. I never eat fish. I never eat fish because I am allergic. You can say, right? It's an example. I am not allergic, right? I never eat fish. So tell me one thing that you always do in the morning. One thing that you always do in the morning. What is something that you always do in the morning? Brush my teeth. Brush my teeth. So you say, I always brush my teeth. Okay. ¿Qué pasó? Come on, come on. Dígale, niño, estoy en clase. I always brush my teeth. ¿Qué es otra cosa que hacen todos los días en la mañana? Pushar. I make up. I make up. I take a shower. I take a shower, right? That's the first one. I take a okay. shower. I put on makeup. I put on makeup. Me pongo put o makeup. me aplico maquillaje, right? I put on makeup. Ch -ch 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 -ch. I put on makeup, right? Put on. I put on makeup. Another sentence that you always do in the morning. ¿Qué más hacen en la mañana? Think about the sentences. What do you do in the morning? I always make the bed. I always make my bed. Very good. Mañana no puedo mandar foto de que la deja hecha. Ah. Sí, siempre oh, no me levanto. I always make my bed, right? Nosotros la dejamos así para que quede lista para cuando vengamos. <laughs> I always make my bed, right? Good, very good. I always make my bed. Another one. Something that you always do in the morning. Who prays in the morning? ¿Quién, ¿Quién reza ahora o algo en la mañana? Nothing, no one. I. Es que sea lo que Dios quiera. I teacher. <laughs> no, we had that's it. Okay. No, we have thanks God in the morning. She prays. Okay. She takes a shower. Good. Very good. Tell me one thing that you never do in the morning. What do you say? Cepillarse los dientes. Ah, how do you say? Brush my teeth. How do you say? Okay, brush my, my teeth. I always go to the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> I always go to the bathroom, right? I always go to the bathroom. That's, yeah, you need to. Si no, mira, todo el día anda. Afligida. Brush my teeth. Brush my teeth. To brush your teeth. Tell me one thing that you never do in the morning. Una que nunca hacen en la mañana. I never play soccer. <laughs> uh -huh. One thing that you never, never watch in TV. In I the never watch TV. I never okay. watch TV. <laughs> yeah, because if you watch TV, yeah, okay. you get distracted. Right? Yeah. It, I never go to the mañana in English. ¿Cómo se dice? What? How to say I never rest in the morning. <laughs> How do you say? Nunca descanso en la mañana. I never rest in the morning. Thank you, Fatima. <laughs> We got the transcription. Okay. Another thing that you never do in the morning. ¿Qué es algo que nunca hacen en la mañana? I never water the plants in the I, morning. In the plants. <laughs> I never water the plants in the morning. Okay. Hasta la tarde. Ah, okay. Hasta la noche. I never water the plants. Do you <laughs> do you eat chicken okay. in the morning? Do you no, eat chicken? <laughs> no, I, I, I never I do them. the cleaning. I never do the cleaning. Cleaning. I never do the cleaning in the morning. Yeah. Or I never clean the house in the morning. Josie. Josie. And the day Rosa Maria, what was your sentence? No cleaning. Ah, clean. <laughs> I never clean in the morning. Tell me, do you eat chicken in the morning? 
no. Do you eat hamburgers in the morning? No. Do, do you eat pizza in the morning? No. 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 Ni, ni que hubiera quedado de la cena. <laughs> ah. Yes. Celo. Celo. Usually. Para no cocinar. <laughs> In the morning. Pizza. Pizza. Pizza from a previous day is very delicious. Yo creo que desayunar pizza con café es uno de esos placeres de la vida. <laughs> ya lo he hecho. Me too. It is very delicious, right? It is very delicious. So here we have other examples, right? Here we have more examples with uh, these ones. What is the example for always? Always watch huh? TV. I always watch TV at night, right? I always watch yeah. TV at night. Let's go with the next one. Almost always, casi siempre. What is the example for this one? I always clean the house at night. I always clean the house at night. Hey, that's good. But good, good, good. ¿Cuál es el ejemplo para almost always? Can you read it, please? Me ayudan a leerlo. She almost right. always eats She breakfast. almost always eats she breakfast. Almost always eats breakfast. breakfast. What about this one? Mike usually... Uh, like I usually get, I usually oh, like oh, oh, the next one. I, I often, often exercise, exercise in the morning. morning. I often exercise I often in the morning. They of they sometimes they sometimes go to Starbucks. I seldom see him. I seldom I I see him. I rarely see him. I hardly ever. I, I hardly ever, ever see, see him. him. And we never. We never come to the class late. We never come to the class late. Never. No. We never come to the class late. Very good question. When you say, I, I seldom see him. Yo casi nunca lo veo. A él. Right? Yo casi nunca lo veo. Imagínese que tengas un tu mejor amigo que vive allá por Chalatenango. Right? I rarely see him. I hardly ever see him. Yo casi nunca lo veo. But you are talking about him. Estamos hablando de El. El. Si estuviéramos hablando de ella, sería I el. seldom see her. Okay. okay. Imagine if you talk about your mother, you say I rarely see my mother. My I, mother. I hardly ever see my brother. My sister. My sister, right? So there you can have it here. Here we have. I have an example for you. And here we're going to do the first. My brother is never. My brother always. Okay. Vamos a ponerle atención a esto. Okay. I am going to mute everybody. Lo voy a poner en silencio porque le voy a explicar. And so we cannot interrupt everybody. We need to pay attention on this one. When you say, my brother is never sad. Okay, my brother is never sad in this part. Okay, what would be the counterpart for this one? Si el nunca está triste, so you say, he is always happy in this case. If you have the next one, okay, I'm going to go here. Um, I was late for work only one time last year. I was late for work only one time last year. Solo fallé una vez. So you say, I am, what would be the adverb of frequency if I only miss one time? Fue casi perfecto, solo una vez fallé. So you say, I am never. never. Hardly ever. Oh, hardly ever, uh -huh, because we miss one time. Fallamos una vez, entonces no somos never. I am hardly ever late 
So it's like, casi nunca llego tarde. I am hardly ever late. Mary failed only one test in high school. She passed her test. Falló solo un examen en high school. She passed her test. Hardly ever. Ah, no, falló solamente uno. Una pero vez. de ahí pasó todos los exámenes. She Shelby. almost... Almost. Always, she almost always passes her test, right? ¿Por qué? Porque solo falló en uno. I always remember to do my homework. Forget to do it. Yo siempre me acuerdo de hacer la tarea. Se me olvida. Never. Never, right? I never. Never. Forget to do it. I never forget to do it. What about the next one? Steven seldom goes to the cinema. He nunca va al cine. Ve películas. What would be similar to seldom? Never. Rarely, no, rarely right? It will be rarely. Because it cannot be never. Porque dice que algunas veces va al cine. Si le ponemos, he never sees movies, es que no, nunca va. Nunca. So, he rarely no, sees movies. Es rara veces ve películas. Judy saw a doctor for the first time in three years. Por primera vez en tres años. She gets sick. ¿Cuál doctor por primera vez en tres años? She... Always. Seldom. Okay, seldom. Hardly ever. Okay, I will, I will go for hardly ever. Hardly ever. ¿Por qué? Porque vio al doctor una vez en tres años. Si yo le pongo, she always gets sick, siempre se enferma. So that's not possible. Eh, sometimes, es bastante seguido. So he, she hardly ever gets sick. Casi nunca se enferma. I get up at five o'clock, seven days a week. Every day. I get up at five o'clock every day. I get up early. Always. I Thanks. always, right? I always get up early, right? Because it happens every day. It's always hot and sunny where I live. That's why I see snow. Vemos nieve, para nada. It's always hot and sunny never. where I live. That's why I... Never. Never see snow. Porque siempre está caliente y soleado. That's why I never see snow. Do you drink coffee? Yes, but only not often. Always. Only, uh, always, always. Ok, aquí dice, miren. ¿Bebe, ¿Bebes café? Sí, pero solamente no siempre. No. No. no está mal entonces porque siempre. I know, I know. It doesn't go with us. But only sometimes. Oh, oh, sometimes. But only sometimes, not often. Just a few times a week. Just a few times a week. Unas cuantas veces a la semana. Okay. Al día. So, al día. <laughs> I know, I know, I know. Coffee, coffee is life, definitely. Okay, yeah. so let's go back here. Volvamos a donde está. So after this big trip with the adverbs of frequency, we go back to this one. And we know where to put the adverb of frequency, right? Ya sabemos dónde lo ubicamos. So, how can we correct this sentence? ¿Cómo corregimos esta oración? What do you have for breakfast? Usually, what do you usually have for breakfast? I, um, I, uh -huh. I, 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 I,
We have. We have. I often have coffee. We have. Exactly, right? Well, I often I have coffee, cereal, mm -hmm. and juice. Whoever what about eat. this one? It says ever. Do you ever eat? Do you ever Do you do you do you ever do you ever eat breakfast at work? And it says sometimes. I sometimes. I have sometimes. Don't say I breakfast at my desk. I sometimes have breakfast at my desk. Or sometimes I have breakfast at my desk. What about the next one? Usually. Do you usually eat rice for breakfast? Very good. For no, Do you I usually eat rice breakfast. for breakfast? And it says like, no, no I hardly ever. Hardly ever. I ever. have rice. I ever have. I hardly ever have rice. What about this one? And it says, I have breakfast on never weekends. And it says. I no. never have breakfast on weekends. I never have breakfast on weekends. How will you transform the second one? ¿Por qué? Porque tenemos sujeto, adverb frequency, the verb, and the complement. What about this one? What is the subject? ¿Dónde está el sujeto de esta? I. I. What is the next I. one? Hardly ever. Hardly ever. Hardly ever. Hardly ever. It is. It is not. It's not. It's not at work. At work. At, work. at work, right? So here you go and say, I hardly mm -hmm. ever eat no. snacks <laughs> at, at work. work. Okay. Tenemos que tener cuidado con snack y snake. Por favor, no me las confundo. Snake is the animal. Snack <laughs> is la merienda. <laughs> What about the next one? How would you make the next one? I. I. Huh? I summit, summit, I, sometimes. I. Sometimes. I sometimes. Eat. Eat pasta, 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 pasta for, for dinner. dinner. For dinner. Pasta. pasta for dinner. I sometimes eat pasta for dinner. Very good. I sometimes eat pasta, pasta for dinner. For eat, eat pasta for dinner. Yes. What about the last one? I often, I often have, often have, have I, I often have dinner, dinner with, with family, with my family, with my family. Okay. okay. I dinner. often, often, I often, often have often. dinner, often. have dinner with my with my family, with my family. Okay. Very good. With my family. I often have dinner with my family. And those are the sentences, right? Specific things for specific sentences. I often have dinner with my family. I sometimes eat pasta for dinner. I hardly ever eat snacks at work. Excellent job. And here I have one a little exercise. How often? How often do you eat these foods? And here we have the different things. How often do you eat pasta? Sometimes. Sometimes, you say. How often do you eat pasta? ¿Qué tan seguido comen pasta? Sometimes. Sometimes. So, okay, sometimes. We have many sometimes. How often do you eat hamburgers? Sometimes. Sometimes, sometimes as well. How often do you eat fish? Often. Seldom. Often. often seldom. Never. 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 How often do you eat eggs? Um, always. Often. <laughs> often, <laughs> often, <laughs> often, often, right? How often do you eat broccoli? Sometimes. Never. Hi. Never. I think it'll be like, por aquí, el never. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Sometimes, right? Por aquí del usually. 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 Every day, teacher. Every day. Como diría mi hijo, yo no como árboles, madre. 
<laughs> that's what that's what he said that he doesn't like listen. he doesn't like to eat a uh, trees okay so we are going to do a little bit of the exercises for today we're going to work in teams vamos a trabajar en grupos y vamos a hacer oraciones we're going to do examples of sentences with the adverbs of frequency i need you please to create sentences with all the adverbs of frequency you are going to create sentences with each of them we are going to take these ones that are here okay esos son los que vamos a utilizar para las oraciones and we are going to use you are going to use all these ones you are going to use all these adverbs of frequency for you to create sentences uno por cada uno Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. You are going to write nine sentences. Son nueve oraciones. And you are going to do it with your group. Okay, no la van a hacer solitos, no se aflijan. You are going to create <coughs> original sentences. Van a hacer oraciones originales, okay? With the adverbs of frequency. And I am going to set you in groups. Vamos a hacer grupos de cinco. Okay, for us to have a lot of participants okay so there you go you are going to create sentences with the adverbs of frequency with any sentence any subject okay i am going to send you the picture Le voy a enviar la foto. There you go. Okay, Vilmita, Roberto, Mirna, no les han llegado mi invitación para los grupos. Okay, Mirna, Roberto, Isabel. ¿Le llegó mi invitación para unirse a los grupos? Yes, thank you. Roberto, Vilmita. You are going to create original sentences with each of the adverbs of frequency. For example, you can say, my mother always cooked breakfast in the morning. Okay, that's one example. Original sentences, one sentence for each of the adverbs of frequency. Mother. Hello. Hello. ¿Cómo vamos? Y vamos, Miss, vamos a hacer una, o sea, nueve cada una del grupo. No, no, no. The group is going to make nine. Las nueve. Todo, todo nueve. el grupo van a ser las nueve. Las mismas nueve. va a tener Violeta, las mismas va a tener Nubia, las mismas va a tener Yami, mm -hmm. las mismas va a tener Wendy. Así ok. Que, La primera, por ejemplo, pueden decir, ok, con always, ¿cuál ponemos? Um, Jamilet always uh -huh. practices o sea, Hacerlas English. entre todos. 
Yeah. You have to make the nine sentences with the group. Así que si le pregunto a Nubia, si le pregunto a Violeta, they are going to have the same sentences. Okay? Va a ser la misma. Yes, okay. the same sentences. Yeah. I will come back. Ya voy. Okay. Uh -huh. Remember, people, that all the group is going to have the same sentence. Los cinco participantes van a tener las mismas nueve. Okay, so you are not going to invent different sentences. You are going to have the same. The same sentences. Okay. Una para always, y decimos, ¿cuál ponemos para always? Ah, Roberto always cooks breakfast. And everybody copies the same sentence. Okay? Nine sentences per group. Sí, cuando regrese le puedo preguntar a Roberto, a Sandra, a Cintia, que todos tienen las mismas oraciones. Okay? You got it? ¿Me queda claro lo que vamos a hacer? Yes? Yes, teacher. Okay, so... Talk and create. Vamos, creemos las oraciones. Vamos. Todo, todos las mismas oraciones. Yes. Todos ah, van a tener las mismas nueve. Diciendo aparte. Ah, ya, ya les hizo el trabajo a todos. Miren. No, you have to create them as a group. Como grupo van a ser nueve oraciones. Ok. So, share the ones that you have. Compártalas para que todos las puedan ver si les gustan o si las cambian. Okay. Yo tengo Supermarket puede ser también. Uh -huh. Supermarket, sí. Good. Hey, you are doing exactly what I need you to do. Nine sentences for the group. That's pretty good. Vamos Never... por some time. That's perfect. Perfect, perfect. Continue. A some time. A veces, a veces. Aquí podemos. <laughs> no, we are here. Don't worry. Ah, yo pensé que estaba terminando la reunión. No, no, no. Don't worry. Ajá. Entonces sería cosa. En realidad, sos usted a la gente. My Harley Everdrive. Solo son pantallas. Mirna. A saber con quién está peleando el Mirnito. Hey, Veronica, what a beautiful cat, the one that you have. Por allá está su gato. Ahí. Ahí está. It's very beautiful. Okay. Chiquito. Yeah, it looks very small. How many sentences do you have? ¿Cuántas llevan? Cuatro. Okay. Hurry up, hurry up. Tenemos tres minutos todavía. Hurry up. Bring a bring a beer. Tiene que ser algo de comida. No importa la oración, así que Ajá. tenemos un ayudante secreto. Hay ah. <risa> cooking de beer. Allá está, mire, <risa> Hay hay ocasional cooking de beer. Okay. Uh -huh. I, okay. I occasionally cook what? The fish. Eh, pescado como, eh, ah, fish. 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 Porque okay. beach, beach is la playa. Come on. Uh -huh. <laughs> Yo dije que chivo que va a cocinar a la playa. Oh. Oh. ¿Cómo, ¿Cómo dijo en la oración? I, I occasionally cook fish. Uh -huh. Cook fish. I occasionally cook fish. Ahora vamos con seldom. Aquí podemos poner. Quiero ver. Hey, Ana y Leticia, how are you? 
Está escondida en el Leticia. Sí, chale, que me está fallando el Inter bastante, porque acá está como, como lloviendo, entonces si enciendo la cámara, escucho como cortado o no me escuchan. Okay, don't Daniel. No. Danielito. Está por ahí. Danielito, en la maca se nos ha de ver dormir. <risa> Danielito, ¿dónde estás? Mimito. Okay. Aquí podemos poner como yo rara vez voy a la playa. Oh, eh, yeah. O rara, ve, rara Ay, vez comemos pavo. Casi nunca comemos. <risa> ya, yeah, bueno. Only, only, es, only for eh, Christmas. Yeah, that's a good example. I seldom. We are about to finish with the sentences. And I am about to bring them back to the class. Okay. Okay, okay. I will bring students back now. Let's have them back. Okay, 40 seconds for students to come back. Hello. Hi, Rosita. Welcome. <laughs> Siempre los agarro aquí con, con los ayudantes desprevenidos. Solo en una me, me quiso ayudar, pero pusimos otra cosa. <laughs> no, but that's good. That's very good. I mean, if he wants to help you, that's perfect, right? Yeah. Que se inscriba también al curso. Sí, fíjese que puede bastante. Y sabe, viendo películas, dice él que ha aprendido porque solo en inglés ve. So he can, he can do the exam and he can take... Uh, an advanced level. Se puede inscribir en un nivel más avanzado. Uh, yeah. Wow. Yeah, he can, he can do it for sure. He, he can practice. En el formulario, cuando le da la opción de qué nivel es el que usted quiere, ahí es donde él se considera el nivel que, que tiene, pre-intermedio, intermedio. Pero mire, teacher, también dan cursos para, porque como él trabaja, entonces está cotizando. Ah, ya. Yeah. Uh -huh, he ya. Yeah. He, he can enter to English for el trabajo. Mm, yeah. yeah, in any of the two. Those are two hours every day. Esos son de dos horas cada día. Ah, okay. Yeah, so he can do it. He can take advantage of that. Que tome ventaja de la oportunidad. Porque esta ya no hay. <laughs> sí, tiene so, Yeah, it, it, it is better. And there are in different times in the day. Hay en diferentes horarios. Así que puedes coger el horario que más le convenga. Okay. So, yeah, in support. 
sí nos motiva a que hagamos este comercial. <laughs> Me trae un comercial. <laughs> no, that's good. That's good. Definitely. Well, my dear class, let's check. Okay, we have five minutes to check sentences. I need volunteers. Volunteers for the different adverbs of frequency. I am going to choose random and I am going to go random and I am going to tell you one adverb of frequency. Okay. Uh, let me see. I am going to go with, let me share here. Okay, here we go. I am going to go. Rosa Maria, you are going to have always. Okay, Rosa Maria me va a dar uno con always. Jennifer Damisela, usually. Reina, normally. Roberto, often. Cynthia, sometimes. Violeta, occasionally. Sandra Beatriz, seldom. Mireia Beatriz, hardly ever. Eh, Nubia Daisy, never. Verónica Elizabeth, always. Mayerly, usually. Eh, Vilma Morejón, normally. Wendy Lisette, eh, sometimes. Roxana Yasmín, occasionally. Roberto Carlos, eh, seldom. Ana Leticia, usually. And... Daniel Edgardo, seldom. Fátima Ivín, always. And Jamilet Ardón, never. Let's go with the examples. Vamos, Rosita, comienza. The microphone, sweetie. I always eat beans. Very good. I always eat beans. Jennifer Damisela. My mother usually cook it. Okay, my mother usually cooks eggs. Eggs, good. Reina Yael. My mom normally cooks beans in the dinner. Very good. Cynthia. I often talk with a tutorial. Okay, I. Often draw with a tutorial. I often draw with a tutorial. Very good. Okay. Vilma Escalante? Violeta Escalante, sorry. He occasionally go to beach. He occasionally goes. He occasionally goes oh. to the beach. Sandra oh. Beatriz? To the beach. Sandrita, creo que se nos ha quedado trabada. Mireya Beatriz? I hardly ever eat tur turkey. I hardly ever eat turkey. Nubia. I never eat a snake. I never eat <laughs> snacks. Snacks. Es de, bueno, no, porque no. sí, I never eat snake. Sí, yo creo que no. Yes, Marino. Mari, eh, dicen que hay, pues, te venden las culebras marinas como clonas. Ah, pues, oh, my man. God. So, it was correct. <laughs> <laughs> Verónica, Elizabeth. I always go to work in the bus. I always go to work by bus. By bus. By bus. Okay. My early. I usually go to the university. I usually go to the university. Vilma Isabel. Uh, I usually eat rice in the lunch. Very good. I usually eat rice for lunch. Mirna Yasmin. I seldom go to the gym. I seldom go to the gym. Roberto. I often go to running. I often go running. I often go, go running. running. Very good. Roxana Yasmin. I occasionally eat it and ice cream. I occasionally eat ice cream. Wendy Lisette. My son sometimes kiss me good morning. Hi, my son sometimes kiss me good morning. Eh, <laughs> 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 oh, sorry, sorry. And answer came about the camera, but this is my way of Danielito. Daniel Edgardo. Hola, voy, permita. Sería. 
the railery failing in class? I early, I rarely. ¿Cuál es el, el complemento? I rarely. Five. I lick in class. I, I cannot get it. Si me la puedes enviar escrita, sería perfecto. Please, for me to, for me to check it. I rarely. ¿Cuál, ¿Cuál era la frase que querías decir? In class, dijo teacher. Ajá, but I got in class. Pero de ahí se me cortó y no lo entendí. Okay, so I will be waiting for that. Patty, maybe? No. La mandó al grupo, dice. I rarely call sleep in class. Ah, I rarely fall asleep in class. Okay. Rara vez me duermo en clase. That's good. That's perfect. Jamilet. I rarely fall asleep in class. Rara sí. veces me duermo en clase. Yo tuve un problema. No escuchaba nada. Entonces yeah. no logré. Eh, perdón. Pero no sé si le puedo dar una así con... Yeah, ¿no? random. Go ahead. Eh, I haven't never been abroad. I hardly ever. Hardly been abroad. What do you want to say? ¿Qué es lo que quieres, qué es lo que quieres decir? Okay. I hardly ever. I have never. Ajá. Ven. Ajá. Abroad. Ah, travel abroad. Travel abroad. I hardly <laughs> ever travel abroad. Casi nunca había. Yeah. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> Very good. Yeah, don't worry. Don't worry. I, I, I have this ability to, to actually discover what do you want to say in the, in the sentences. Okay, my dear students, I am going to uh, call the attendance and you can go to sleep. Okay, le voy a pasar lista y se pueden ir a dormir una vez que me digan present. Okay. So there you go. Oh, Anita, se le fue la señal. Okay, so I think everybody was in class. So let me see. Whenever I call your name, tan pronto les pase lista, se pueden ir a acostar, okay? Let's see. Hey, congratulations. All of you finished the platform. That's beautiful. Let's see. Let's go here. Ana Leticia was here. She had a lot of problems with the internet. Anaya Milet, she was also here. Eh, Cynthia Marisol. Present. Daniel Edgardo. <coughs> Fatima Ivin. Present. Thank you. Fatima Ivin. Present. Thank you. Mayerle Alejandra. Present, teacher. Thank you. Have a good night. Mayerle Yasmin. Mireya. Beatriz. Present. Nelson, Mirna Yasmin. Present, teacher. Okay. Yeah. Daisy. Present, teacher. Thank you. Reina Joel. Present. Roberto Carlos. Dijo que nos podíamos ir. Yes, you can go. As soon as I call you. Tan pronto lo llamen, se pueden ir. Thank you, Roberto. Rosa María. Present teacher, good night. Have a good night, Roxana Yasmin. Roxana Jamilet. I'm here. Thank you. Sandra Beatriz. Sandrita was frozen. Se me había quedado congelada la Sandrita. Eh, okay, here we go. Veronica Elizabeth. Vilma Concepción. Present. Thank you. Vilma Isabel. Present teacher. Violeta Elizabeth. Present teacher. Wendy Lisette. Y Jennifer Damisela. Present teacher. Thank you very much. Have a beautiful night, my dear students. I'm going to see you tomorrow for another class. Bye-bye. Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye. Have a good night. Very good night. Bye-bye.